What's up guys, welcome back to React for another Foster's Home for Magic and Friends Reaction. Mo here, back to React for episode 12 of season 1 of Foster's Home. I want to recap last episode real quick, it was who let the dogs in? Uh, someone tried to bring a dog to the Foster's Home, but they don't allow dogs in mostly because, well, they it's a Magic and Friends house and also Harry Man has a dog fear. He's scared of dogs. Bro. And then, uh, but actually, uh, Waro finds a dog and tries to hide it from everybody else. It was really uh, a cute little lovable dog. Recommend checking that out if you have it. Don't want to spoil it, but there is quite a pretty crazy surprise at the end that I want you guys to check out. So go check that out if you haven't seen it. If you have only 11% of you who watch my videos, start subscribing. So if you haven't hit that subscribe button, please hit that. It will be real fast. I appreciate you came back. Watch for more. I'll see you guys in the next one. Wait, we haven't even watched it yet. Let's get right, right, jump right into his reaction. Let's go. What bam? Ed. Oh, apocalypse. But that's not how you spell apocalypse. I can't read that real fast. It was. I don't want to go back, but apocalypse. Now, I'm sure, it was a play on that movie, which I've never seen or heard of. Have you guys ever heard of that movie? Adopt. Apocalypse. Adopt. Apocalypse. Now. I don't know how to say that. What's going on here? Once they're picnicking? Those picnic games? Oh, they're getting all ready up, all goodied up. Oh. Oh. Shit. <laughs> He's auditioning. Are they having some big adoption day or something? There was a lot of people got adopted when Harry Man's video went viral. It kind of looks like that clown from the Powerpuff Girls. Do you guys know the one where he went all black and white? Okay, okay. Well, here's a new one I've been working on all week. It's perfect for tonight. Who's bringing a joke to them? <laughs> Why do you gotta whisper it? Why can't you just say it out loud? It's the whole episode gonna be about this secret joke. Why does this door look like the Taj Mahal? Oh, good. I was hoping to find you. What is that? Is that one of those? Oh! Oh my god. Well, stop splashing her, bro. He can't help? I know you want to be part of all the fun, but you gotta stay inside today. We wouldn't want someone taking you home. Oh. Adopt Calypso. Come on, Why was she carrying them in the first place? Here, have a cupcake. I don't want no cupcake. I want a cupcake. I don't want no sticky cupcake. It's called the funniest joke. Oh, really? Yeah, it's just two jackrabbits. Two jackrabbits. Oh, yeah, to tell us a joke? Two Jack Russells. What's a Jack Russell? They're not telling the joke right, they're ruining it. You gotta stay inside. Uh oh. Rules are rules! Oh, okay. Well, you can't get adopted, so you can't be outside. Is it outside thing? Adopt a thon. Why do they call it Adopolis? How do you know how to say it? Adopt Pocalypse? That's cool, they're having a cool thing outside. I like that. It must be hard to adopt a imaginary friend when, like, you can just think of one. I guess some kids can't. It's like that one girl who had a headache whenever she tried to think. Prospective families will certainly have questions for you. Oh. So people are item thorough when answering their He's helping you out. Family, when a friend is matched with a new family, you are required to complete these forms Aww. in triplicate. Need I remind He's gonna do all that? You gotta pay him now. He wasn't paying attention, bro. He, he was thinking about the joke. What the? Oh my god, he's ruining everything trying to tell this joke, but he's telling it badly. <laughs> he's making things not good. Joke, you were joking the clown. I haven't seen him. Good, 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 good. There you folks. He got adopted. There goes Jokey. Oh, he gets a hug and everything. See you later, buddy. We'll see you when the kid grows up. <sighs> Maybe. When is he getting back? A couple of years. I mean, how long do people keep their imaginary friends? <laughs> That's what happens. Adopt a thought Saturday? Adopt a thought? Oh, adopt a thought. Yeah, man, people get adopted. Come on. Can you pick up on this? Why are you freaking out? What do you think happens around here? It's adopt a foster's home. 
He's not coming back. He saw it out through the window. That's why he can't be out there. <laughs> He's stealing our jokes. <laughs> they don't want to lose their imaginary friends. Oh, what if they leave? That would be sad. Are they now getting the concept of adoption? What's well, been going on this whole time? Maybe this episode was out of order. It should have been before the Harry Men. Hippity hoppity hoop. Wait, what's Blue gonna plan to stop the adopt a thon? That's kind of messed up though. These guys want to be adopted. Let's wait, these cupcakes. They smell so good, huh? Yo, well, I want a cupcake. Whatever that is. Whatever that smells. Man! This is part of Blue's plan, but what could he have possibly put in these cupcakes that are so good that would keep everybody from uh, wanting to be adopted? It's so distracting. You can't not get some cupcakes, bro. Oh my gosh. <laughs> They're fishing people inside. What the? This is criminal. Harry made all these rules. Rules. Miss Francis. Miss Francis. Oh, yeah, whoa. Is that the one he rescued? You got a brand new car from that? Where is that car? I'm throwing all the little ones. Oh. Yeah, that's not going to work. All the furry little ones. Oh. <laughs> it worked. Man, cupcakes are real popular today, huh? It's Coco Lane. Oh, my friend. Oh. oh. Coco. Oh, they're putting friends in there. <laughs> oh, I like that furry one. Coco came back? Uh oh. Madame Foster, but she's always chill. What is she going to do? <laughs> That's her po poker buddy? Oh, oh, oh. You can't. <laughs> You gotta stop from taking him, bro. Is she for this? She's so unpredictable. Put him back inside. Ha <laughs> Slip. Uh oh. Oh. <laughs> He's naked. Does Coco still work at the mall? Technically. Yo, where's your pants? Pantsless Joe? Yo, my man's not wearing any pants. Coco! Coco! What are you doing inside? Coco! <laughs> Do they understand Coco yet? Oh, they put him in the closet. What's shaking? Oh, they put water on right here? Uh oh. Will Smart can't lie to Will. Oh, well, they can't, I feel like. I feel like he would believe him. He's so nice. Yikes. Yeah. Tell us. Oh. In trouble. What is the plan? Dang. Weapon? Whoa. Oh, okay. Poor Eduardo. Man, he wants to go home with his little girl. She seems nice. That's kind of messed up. Aww. I feel sad. Oh. Bad now. I mean, she wants to be friends with Eduardo. Oh. She saved you from the spider. Oh no. Man, why do I feel bad now? Okay, I was pretty crazy. Wow, you didn't go that far. Though. Jeez, Louise. No, they ruined the top the top Saturday. The top they said sent over Hamy. Oh, would they be so mean? Hey, <laughs> man's pants. 
I didn't notice that. Yo. You saw that mean face Mac put on? How many cupcakes he got? What the Maybe. No one's making off with our friends today. Oh, they're back, baby. And well, free. Uh oh. What a cupcake? Don't change the subject, please. And none of my friends may finally have a chance to find new What are they doing? They can assault Will. Oh, Tim, he's like a tree. Whoosh! Oh my gosh, wow. This hurts us more than it hurts you. Yeah, sorry, Wilt. Oh my god. That's troubling. Hey, where did all the people go? Hmm. Awesome. And they're back. What do you mean? There's no people around. It's late in the day. We can handle this. can happen. School bus. Let's go. Ha. <laughs> it's Saturday. Saturday, yeah. Field trip? What is this? Blue? <laughs> oh, he's going to distract the friends. So they want to adopt him instead. Ow, that one looked, that little girl looked like the other little girl. <laughs> Bruh. Oh, we're just having a bad day. Y'all ruined his day. Y'all should feel bad. <laughs> He's gonna save them from being mean, mean to too. I don't know. He's gonna save the kids. For Perry Man and Frankie. What the? That's not comfortable. Oh, watch out! Oh, scared the pants off him. <laughs> oh! He. <laughs> School bus, school bus, everybody in the school bus. Ooh, oh, and then they're gone. Wow, that was quick work. Wow. What? Oh. Wait, what? Did he fake that? A perfect it. Uh oh. Uh oh. How is it gonna fake? Oh. <laughs> well, it won't escape. Whoa. They stopped from everywhere. Name a friend, so and so. Uh oh. Mr. Man and Lady Ladington. This is preposterous. Preposterous. Do you feel all those up? Uh oh. Next Saturday. Is it top the thought always on Saturdays? Sorry, but believe me. Oh, this <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Serves them right, though. Just deserve, they deserve that one. <laughs> they tied a brutal, but it had to be done. Now, I want to look up some more information about this episode. Adopt Apocalypse. I thought it was going to be a little crazy. Like, end of the world or something. I don't know. Trivia. Mac is out of character in this episode, as he helps Blue in one of these schemes enforcing the friends back into the house to stop them from being adopted. Mac is out of character in this episode as he helps Blue in one of his schemes enforcing the friends back into the house and stopping them from being adopted. Mac usually loves helping imaginary friends find good homes and would never go along with Blue schemes. This is probably because the episode was the sixth episode produced of the season but it ended up airing the 12th. That's the 12th? This Wait, I thought, what? Oh, whatever. Huh, I wish they aired them in order of production. Because this definitely should have came up before the Harry Man viral video episode where like a bunch of them got adopted. And yeah, Mac was out of character. Maybe he just really, he was really torn about jokey's jokes and him getting adopted. The name of this episode is reference to 1979's Apocalypse Now, a movie set in the time of the Vietnam War and based on the book the Heart of Darkness. Never heard of that book. Never seen the movie. I didn't know it was a Vietnam book. I thought it was really about the apocalypse or something. At one point, Max, Mac makes the iconic Grinch smile from the How, how the Grinch Stole Christmas. I did think of that when he made that smile. I remember he was like, 
You guys saw it. Anyways, that was the end of that episode. I really hope you guys liked that. That was pretty good. The concept of adoption. So I wonder how canonically this show will get, because this definitely should have been before the Harriman. And after the Harriman episode, a lot of friends got adopted. So how many friends, recurring friends will we see? How many, how full will the house be? I don't think we will be able to tell. It's a big house and they're always walking around. There's always no imaginary friends. So I'm sure when, if some get adopted, when those kids grow up, they come back to the house and they get adopted again. Do some recycling, you know. They leave the house and come back in a couple years. It happens. Well, guys, thank you for watching. The next episode will be the season finale of episode season one. So if you stuck around for that, please drop a like. Come back for that one. Well, it shows only get better from better from here. There is like six seasons, so you know it's a good one so if it lasts that long. And uh, thank you guys for watching this my newest show after KND. Let me know what you guys think. I mean, you know what other guys? Anything you want me to react to? And I'll think about it. Put it on my list. And I'll see you guys for the next one. Peace out. Mo out.